Today we're talking about my top 10 productivity apps for Mac I simply can't live without. Let's get into it. Number 10, we're starting with Sigma OS, which is an amazing new gen browser. Everything is super clean with a navigational sidebar on the left. Your tabs are organized into different workspaces with different profiles, and you can even invite people into your workspace to collaborate with them. You've also got a ton of super smart keyboard shortcuts, and you even have an AI co-pilot integrated within the browser. Sigma basically gets rid of all the distraction and makes it so easy to organize your work and stay focused on what matters. Check out my video right here where I compared Arc and Sigma if you're interested in learning more about it. Number nine is actually two apps, text.com and Beeper. They bring all your different messages from LinkedIn, Slack, iMessage, WhatsApp, Instagram, and many more into one single place. I mentioned two apps because I actually use them both on a daily basis, even though they're quite similar. And so definitely watch this comparison video I made if you want to understand why. Number eight is Hey. It's an email client built by the people at Basecamp and it does exactly what you think it does. It lets you read your emails. Although it might have less features than something like Gmail, I still think it's better simply because of all the time and mental energy it's been saving me. It's a completely new take on the email experience. People don't automatically just have access to you. It can spam you all the time. You actually have to screen them or kind of like accept them before they can keep messaging you in the future. Once you accept somebody, you have to actually categorize them. So for example, they might go into your inbox. This is for all the people that you actually really care about and want to hear from, or they might go into your feed. This is for all the newsletters and other type of content that you want to read, but at your own time. Or you can even put them into your paper trail. This is, for example, for all the accounting or bills that you might receive. It's all about putting you back in control of your own time and your inbox. Number seven. Limlist. Limlist is by far the best cold outreaching tool on the market and it's not even close. I've raised over a million euros for my startup and closed even more in sales in an almost fully automated way in large part thanks to Lemlist. This is how you send a hundred highly personalized messages every day, both on LinkedIn and emails, and actually stay on top of it. Their whole family of apps does so much more. So for example, they have Lemworm, which will warm up your email to make sure you never land in the spam folder. They have Lemcal, which is a great way to book more meetings. They also have Tweet Hunter and Taplio, which will grow your Twitter and your LinkedIn accounts for you. The best part is that it perfectly integrates with the next tool on this list, HubSpot. You could call HubSpot the ultimate CRM, but that wouldn't do it justice. HubSpot is close to being the ultimate platform to managing all aspects of your business. This is where you keep track and manage all your contacts, customer relationships, deals, sales, marketing, customer support, and so much more. It honestly has too many features to count. The ones I use the most, and by that I mean every day, are probably emails, notes, meetings, calls, video calls, deals, templates, notes, and dashboards. HubSpot is absolutely amazing and really easy to start using. They're also releasing a ton of new features, and especially AI features, very, very regularly, which is great. I actually kind of hate how good it is, to be honest, because at this point, I know I'm here for life. Let's get to our number five, ClickUp which is one of the best work management tools on the market. You might already know of other tools like Notion, Asana, and many, many more. There's quite a lot, but I personally really like ClickUp and I use it for my personal projects as well as for Busy, my startup, and where we all collaborate on it. It does all the classic task tracking things, etc., that you might expect it to do, and it's even more powerful once you start connecting it to some of the other apps you're using with something like Zapier, which is our fourth tool. Zapier is an incredibly useful tool, which lets you connect virtually any app on the internet to each other and create all these amazing workflows. For example, you can automatically send a new email from Gmail every time there's a new row added to a Google Sheet, or push a message notification to your Slack channel every time somebody fills a new form on your website, and so much more. Its power really comes from the fact that you can connect pretty much every single app you already use on a daily basis to each other, but especially that you can create these complex multi-step automated sequences that will save you hours and hours every week. I'm honestly not exaggerating when I'm talking about all the hours you can save using Zapier, and I'm personally never going back. Let me know in the comments, actually, if I should make a video about this and maybe show you some of my best apps. Next up on the list is Slack, and you probably saw this coming. This list wouldn't be completed without Slack on it, and you probably already know about it. If you don't already know what it is, Slack is a super powerful messaging tool for Teams. This is kind of like the default communication app these days for most companies, especially tech startups. Kind of like Discord, but for business. You can create a new workspace for a team and neatly organize your conversations into different channels with threads and many subthreads. 
It of course also integrates with many other apps that you might already be using like Zapier, HubSpot, Google Calendar and it also has a crazy amount of customizations and extra features like GIFs or GIFs, voice messages, voice and video calls, notes, docs, files, automations, shortcuts and much more. So this is definitely where you spend most of your time communicating with your team. I'm the type of person that lives my life by my calendar. If it's not in the calendar, it doesn't exist and it's not happening. So of course, the next tool is Google Calendar. It allows me to efficiently manage my time and priorities without having to deal with the mental load of having to try and remember everything. Any calendar app that you might be using is probably gonna do the job, but I personally really like Google Calendar because of its interface, how smooth everything is, and how well integrated it is with all the apps I already use. If you pay for Google Workspace, which I do through my company, it becomes literally 10 times better. You can't really escape Google, right? It's just, it's just really good. Last but not least, Loom. Loom is a video recording tool that does exactly that, lets you record videos. Most importantly, recording videos of yourself while sharing your screen at the same time. It's honestly the best way there is to record yourself and your screen to give presentations, to do sales, to onboard new people and share ideas, thoughts or literally anything else. And it saves me hours of meetings every week. What makes it super powerful are all the analytics and settings you have access to. You'll know exactly who watched your video, how, when, where and for exactly how long, giving you lots of super actionable data. It also has a bunch of AI features integrated which will automatically generate the title, summary, chapters of the video for you as well as a transcript. I've personally used it a lot for sales and fundraising to introduce myself and what we do. It has replaced pretty much any sort of presentation I might have done before. People can then comment and ask questions at very specific timeframes, which is great. And I also embed a button to schedule a call with me through HubSpot. And I of course connect it to Zapier to send me notifications, for example, on Slack when something important happens on that video and automatically following up with whoever watched it. Everything is connected. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to subscribe to enjoy more content like this and let me know in the comments what other apps you think I should have added to this list. Thanks a lot and see you soon.